parts of a plant their functions there are two main parts in a flowering plant they are one root system two shoot system root system the part of a plant that lies below the surface of the soil is root it is light in color has many branches in plants like marigold main root grows vertically downwards into the soil this is called tap root or parent root in plants like paddy grass we find many small roots arising from the point where the stem touches the ground these roots are called fibrous roots functions of root system fix the plant in the soil absorb water and minerals from the soil and supply them to the leaf through stem in some plants like carrot radish beetroot sweet potato root store food in some trees when branches are widely spread some roots arise from the branches and give support to the main stem example aerial roots of banyan tree shoot system the part of the plant which grows vertically above the ground is called stem branches leaves buds flowers fruits are formed on stem the part of the stem at which leaf arises is known as node the region between two nodes is called internode the bud at the end of the stem is called terminal bud it is also called apical bud the angle between the leaf and stem is called axil functions of stem gives support to branches leaves and fruits establishes connection between roots and leaves supplies water and minerals supplies the food material prepared in the leaves in young plants the stem also performs photosynthesis in some plants the stem stores the food material example sugarcane in desert plants the stem performs photosynthesis example opuntia <coughs> gives support to climbers leaf parts of a leaf there are three important parts in a leaf they are one leaf base two petiole three lamina or leaf blade one leaf base the lower part of the leaf where the leaf attaches to the stem near the node is called leaf base two petiole the stem like part of the leaf that joins the leaf blade to the stem is known as petiole or leaf stalk three lamina or leaf blade the green expanded portion of leaf is called lamina or leaf blade it is green in color due to the presence of chlorophyll there are many rigid branch structures spread on the lamina these are called veins the long vein present in the middle of the lamina is called the midrib functions of leaf prepares food material by the process called photosynthesis regulates the consumption of oxygen and carbon dioxide regulates the transportation of water and salts by the process called transpiration modifies as thorns in desert plants modifies as coil structures in climbers in weak stemmed plants helps in vegetative reproduction example bryophyllum flower flower is located at the axil or at the apex of the stem parts of a flower flower is attached to the stem with a stalk this stalk is known as pedicel the upper part of the pedicel is swollen it is called thalamus on the thalamus all the floral parts are arranged in four orals they are 1 calyx 2 corolla 3 andrisium 4 gynecium or pistil